You got a minute? Yeah, I got a minute. Do you? Yeah. Cool. It's a one minute Wednesday. Awesome. That means we're going to find one cash. In one minute. Cue the title. Start the clock. Go. Trespassers butchered. Uh oh. <laughs> I don't know about that. <laughs> All right, you ready? Ah! No. Whoa! Holy wow, doodle! Huge. You've had that one. Yeah. Yeah, we had. You had that in a video. Um, that's from. We brought this from the crappy cache back home and sent it on its way, and now it's here. That is so cool to see a trackable that uh, Lyric Glass picked up over a year ago right here in another awesome indoor cache. This is really cool. There are trackables in the box, the smaller ones. <laughs> oh, Apollo and me. Oh, we know Apollo and me. Oh, Geocaching Capital of Canada. I have, they're going to drop off one of our new mm -hmm. Cache Canada hitchhikers. There's a spot There's right a here. There's a spot right there. <laughs> Does this guy look familiar to you? In Ontario, I'm sure he would. Juice pig. <laughs> and we just happen to be with the Cache owners. They're right here. There they are. That's uh, Tom Tech and the Elf have put together this awesome cash and here's our log yep. on the log book what inspired you to do a backyard cash treasure treasure it's all about the <laughs> treasure. all about the treasure all something big treasure. enough you can actually have tradables in and nice yeah. a lot of people to go nice safe place <gasps> <laughs> a place for somebody to drop off the really big ones big big yeah. travel bugs yeah yeah oh, don't some. That. that's awesome so this cash has been here since 2011 yep yeah and what was your you know, your inspiration obviously was because of large items or to yeah, share. just to ha have have cool tradables that people can find. Yeah. So this was a recreation of a previous cache that you had here. Uh, before this one, we had one in in a Toyota Echo parked in our driveway. So that's where where the treasure chest originally that's came right. from. That's uh, right, and it was called Echo of the Past. Oh, okay. Uh, yep. Yeah. A whole there's, new can of beans. Yeah, Echo of the Past, whole new can of beans. Uh, so I tried oh, to rhyme okay. it. Oh, uh, well, yeah, that's in the description. Yeah. It, it, that it talks, was the title yeah, of it. Yeah, and it talks it. about that in the description. Yeah, the and, then, and then, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, so it gives the name. And well, I got to bring some treasure with me, so I got some wall pops, so I have to check this out. Cool. It's got, it's got it's, smiley face. You can pick stuff up. You can also drop stuff off. I'm dropping off this really cool earth cash coin, and then I'm going to pick one up from the box, too, so I don't want to leave something there, but we're going to do a trade. We're going to do a swap for trackables, because that's what it's all about, the treasure. That was a really cool cache. That was a lot of fun. Yeah, it was just like, we were suggested uh, this one by a friend of ours, Bin Rat. He said, if you're traveling through Georgetown on your way up north, that you should stop here. And I thought, oh, no, we're not going to come here. But the GPS directed us this way, so and he's like, wait a minute. Yeah, Georgetown. Georgetown. <laughs> <laughs> and so I looked up the cache, and I think it was only a kilometer away, so we had to stop, and it's awesome. This cache has over 200 favorite points. Yeah. So. This more. is the uh, crappy cache of the north, but this one's not crappy. <laughs> <laughs> Keep watching, there's more caches to be found. Yeah, where will geocaching take you? To find some treasure. Yeah! It's right in there. Oh, you found it already? Yeah. Oh, okay. Hey, but I thought it was one cache, one minute. Yeah, it's supposed to be one cache, one minute, but Remember that trackable that we found at the shed? Yes. Yeah, it's right here, and oh. this trackable... It wants to go to Port Severn. Port Severn. And we just happened to be driving through Port, Port Severn. Severn. And the cache that's right there where you are is the Port Severn TB Hotel. Hotel. Perfect. Isn't that amazing? Wow, oh, that's a beauty. Gotta love an ammo box. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, it's a cocoon. It's a cocoon for a, a, a bug. I can't is it? I don't know what kind it is. I can't we'll have to look it up. It's a butterfly cocoon, so we have to be careful. So we wanted to make sure we showed this one because it's kind of cute. Uh, when we were at the, uh, where were we? Is it all blurry or is it just me? No, it's just you. Okay, let me take my glasses okay. off then. Maybe I'll be easier. Okay, go for it. When we were at that uh, One Minute Wednesday cache with the shed, uh, I picked this one up and we logged it. 
When you pick up a trackable, check and see where it, where it wants to go, what destination it wants to end up at. Well, it just happened to be here at Port Severin. Yeah, and we just happened to be driving by. So I thought, hey, let's check to see if there's a TB hotel. And there was one right where we pulled off the road. So we're gonna drop this one in here. That's one of its goals is to go to Port Severn. It also wants to go to Alaska and some other place so we're not going to alaska anytime soon so yeah. this will have to be it so already this one started in january of 2020 it's got to its one goal location already there you go isn't that cool one cash wednesday yeah okay you do that okay okay um what do i say first oh you got a minute yeah i got a minute do you 